what is the origin of this idea that the adult responsible citizenry of the United States is just under constant danger of being misled in such a way that the citizenry needs to be protected from itself. Yeah. Can you kind of trace this back as sort of archaeology of this? So free speech um, is the, the historical exception rather than the rule. Our constitutionally protected right of free speech is not the norm throughout human history. Every regime in power has always been interested in controlling the flow of information and in uh, influencing what the population that they're ruling thinks. Uh, I, I think that's a, just a perennial inclination, temptation, if you will, of power uh, as a way of solidifying power, as a way of uh, protecting oneself against any challenges to my power or my policies. It's, it's a natural human inclination that our founding fathers understood uh, had to be rein, reined in with a very, very strong legal framework because you know even a virtuous leader is going to be inclined to think that he or she knows best for everyone else and to try to challenge opposition by getting them to shut up, which is what most regimes have done throughout most of human history, but what we were trying to be an exception to. So we have very strong First Amendment free speech uh, protections in this country precisely because um, it, it, the, the desire to censor is always going to be there and it's always going to fly under the banner of what's best for the population of health and safety especially you know preventing some disastrous outcome from happening and uh, and we saw that of course during covid in spades that health and safety proved to be a very strong fulcrum for this this lever of you know increased government emergency powers and you know a widespread exception uh you know acceptance of a censorship regime.